Welcome back, meteorologist Autumn Robertson bringing you a quick update on what's going on in the tropics and a lot is going on. It's peak hurricane season and we're already seeing six uh, areas that we're currently watching to our tropical storms. Let's talk about Paulette really quickly. Paulette is making its way to the west northwest still rather slowly. It has increased in wind speeds just a bit, 65 miles per hour. Bermuda is now in the cone of uncertainty and it could reach Bermuda as a category two storm. By this weekend it is expected, I think those times just shifted on me there. By this weekend it is expected to uh, reach hurricane strength and then even strengthen a bit more as we head into next week. Renee is right behind it, is not looking that good, and is expected to be a fish storm as you get into the next several days, not being a threat to anyone. Taking you out to the waves off the coast of Africa, we have Invest 95L now that has a good chance of developing into a tropical depression or even a storm as we get into this weekend and also into next week. Uh, disturbance uh, right behind it there is going to be heading off of the coast of Africa over this weekend. Still has a relatively low chance of developing in the next two days, but by next week, we could get a depression out of that one too. Here's a closer look at Invest 95L. It's a very broad area, but if it gets its act together, we could get a good storm out of it. And here's a look at the services a little bit closer to us. Now, one wave that's just to the east of Florida will have to cross over Florida as we get into the weekend. That will increase our rain chances, but it has a better chance of actually developing once it gets out into the Gulf. It will not be a threat to us once if, if it does develop and another disturbance in the Gulf at this point not really showing good signs of organization right now but it could head west and eventually southwest as we get into the next several days.